Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's have that conversation now, shall we? Well, if it isn't Bunio, hmm, you heard me. Hmm, I can't say I expected you to manage to rescue the elder. I told you I could do it. Don't get a swelled head. This doesn't mean I'll accept you as our leader. And it definitely doesn't mean I completely trust that mustache guy either. For starters, you haven't rescued the other punies yet. I'm not lifting an antenna to help you help until you do. You stubborn mule! <laughs> Deplorable. How dare you talk like that? Look what we're up against. We must stand together now. We must take back our tree. Don't you understand that? But, but, Elder... <laughs> Shut your trap, Puniper. And mind me, you hear? You'll have Mustachio here. What'd you say your name was again? It was, uh, it was Marty, wasn't it? Hmm. It's Mario. He's Mario. I mean, jeez, he's the only world famous. Come on. Yes, yes, simmer down you, and everyone else, help Mario clear out the tree. They'll never get Mario's right, Mario's name right in this game, I swear. <laughs> oh, alright, Elder, whatever you say. I'm not heartless or anything. To tell you the truth, I'm worried about Petunia too. And you're right, we have no choice. We must fight. Right, everybody? All together now with squishiness! Woohoo! We've got ten punies in our party. Well, actually, we've got eleven because we've got Punio as well. Anyway, thanks, you guys! Hey, if you're done rallying your phone, I have a question. We're looking for this crystal star thingamajig. Ever heard of it? Crystal star, eh? Mm, yes, perhaps. Written down, down at the bottom of this tree is a funny colored stone. But what do we do with it? All right, guard from evil and give it to a pure heart. That's what generations of elders have been taught. Might be a crystal star. Marty, or Mario, I'm thinking you better get it before those goons do. I don't quite see how just yet, but I bet it's connected to us getting our chi back. Got all that, Mario? Crystal star, bottom part of the tree, go to it. Sound good. Hmm? More, really? Oh, hold your horses. I forgot something. Before you can get to the crystal star, you must save all the captured punies. Yep, you'll never get to that gem without the help of the punies. Not a chance. So here, you better take this. It's the puny arm. It's a symbol of our leader. Whoop. If you place this in the pedestal, you see her on the tree and the boonies will gather. Just remember to take the orb with you when you're done using it. Because, well, if you don't, everyone will just ha kind of hang out and stare at the orb. Yeah, they got this weird attention span. <laughs> You'll see when I get into it. <clears throat> Alright, guys, let's go rescue everybody! Woohoo! Got anything else to say? Are you ready, Mario? The crystal star is at the very bottom of the tree. For the sake of when you try this future, you mustn't give in to those things. Oh, one more thing. So sorry, so sorry, I've been awfully forgetful as of late. No one, well, where was I? Alright, on your way to the crystal star, lose any of the poonies and have a hard time finding them, just come see me. What I'll do is I'll give him a whistle to call him back here. You got all that? So she's like the reset button of sorts to the upcoming puzzles if you ever lose any punies along the way. Don't worry, it's not all that difficult to keep them all together. Now you see that number? See that number? Well, I'll put this here and then they all just sort of like twitch and spaz out in excitement and then that button will press in. Yeah, it's a combination between the puny orb and the punies themselves. Oh look, a new pipe! Come on, let's jump in! First take this, otherwise you're just gonna just gonna hit hang around there. <laughs> so let's tackle new ground. Oh I'll battle you fine. <laughs> Bring it on, sucker. Oh my god. Goodness, two fire flowers. I really better take care of you quickly. And I'm forgetting to do the stylish moves again. There we go. <laughs> I should just like stop talking whenever I do an attack so I can focus on the stylish move for the attack or something. Because I just keep forgetting about it for some reason. Um, oh, over here. Now this is sort of like a pipe between halves of this place. You see, you've got some water here, got some punies. They, 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 get, they get stuck on the edge there, as you can tell, but that's you'll see uh, why they do that a little bit later. Ooh, Thunder Rage. Ooh, oh, seriously? Um. Oh, good lord, I'm, <laughs> I'm hoarding items again. 
shine the sprite right there. I kind of clicked past it a little bit too quickly for, for you to see, but I'm pretty sure you could see that it was indeed a shine sprite. But anyway, as I said, the punies, they hang along the, along the edges, so once you jump across here, they don't really do much of anything. They can't cross. So how do you do this? Well, first plop that there. Switch partners to Flurry. And blow them into the bubbly water. Take this out, by the way. And now blow them across. Oh, no, no, no. No, oh, come on. Yep, yeah, don't worry, they'll come back up again. You just gotta... There we go. I wasn't aligned the first time, so I didn't get... Oh, oh, so I didn't get all of them. Dang it, I need that one. Fall back down. I was... Come on. Go. There we go. Now, once you see it hit... Zero. Wait, what? Oh, what? I thought it was gonna hit zero. Where'd that other one go to then? Are they all with me? I, I, I think they are. I guess I'll see when I go down this pipe. I'm pretty sure I got all of them. I hope. <laughs> I hate to have to go to the elder. Okay, we got eleven. Um, new enemy coming up right here. This is a piter. And it's just as monochrome as the other enemies around this area, as is the beautiful theme of this place. They have a way of being either close to the ground or up high. So they're, they're kind of like a combination between an aerial and a ground enemy, depending on where their position is on the web. I think that should be pretty obvious, but... I gotta swap partners, so I better stop talking here. <laughs> Let's tattle that piter. Woo! That's a piter! It gross me out! Max HP is 5 and defense is... Th attack is 2 and defense is 0! Eww! Besides its normal attacks, it might spit 3 web wads at you consecutively. You better have a good time if you want to guard against its attacks. It also says here that the punies can't stand piters. I'm not the only one. Just the sight of these things make punies flee in terror. I know how they feel. Wait to guard? Oh yeah! Just... This is a real, actually a really easy to uh, guard attack because it's a projectile coming at you. You just press the A button just as it's coming at you and the timing window is nice and wide. Um, maybe what I should do actually is swap head bonk this one. Oh! Boopers! <laughs> I focused on trying to do the stylish move and I did it a little bit too early and I forgot Mario's stylish move. I will never remember to do stylish moves this whole walkthrough, will I? <laughs> Alright, let's try it again. Stylish. Oh, poopers. That was a little bit too early in my timing there. But that's okay. It's only got one HP left, so... Oh! Almost got the second stylish move in the jump. I'll get the hang of him again. Don't worry. Then again, even if I don't, I'm sure I'll be able to 100% this walkthrough anyway. <laughs> so anyway, as you see, we've got, we've got six now because that piter scared them away. So they are most likely down there. Uh, oops. I got to do something here. Whoop, whoop, whoop. There we go. See, I know you could blow, blow away some of these. I just wanted to see those first couple of vases just for the heck of it. Don't worry, I'm going to go back up there for the other ones. I just want to do this really quick here first because there's a shine sprite right here. So do not forget about that. Now I'm going to... Wait, wait, wait. It's, oh, go back up. And here they are. Come on, guys. Yay! Oh, oh. I guess I could have dropped them off down here first. And I hope the other seven are down here. Yep, there's one. Stop it! Ah. <laughs> sneaky, sneaky. Oh, we got two here. Well, I guess I can show off how Flurry attacks here. So, body slam time. This, this cursor kind of drifts. And when she hits the ground, press the A button to do the stylish move. So yeah, you gotta kick, line up the cursors and keep them lined up is basically the key to that. And there we go. Alright, bring it on. Aha! Um, I'm pretty sure you can't like body slam that because it's considered like a jump. And it's got the spiky mouth, I mean, you know, the toothy mouth, that's not going to be very pretty. Yeah, oops, I was a little bit early on my uh, stylish timing there. That's okay. Just gotta get the hang of this stuff again. Yep, I got the hammer down pretty decently, like, in as per reflex. Oh, come on now. 
I'm better than that. <laughs> Body slam with the power of Snorlax! Yeah! Woo! And I think there aren't any... Oh, wait, wait. Oh, I got them all here. I mean, I got all the punies here, but I'm thinking if there's any more enemy. Oh, there is one more enemy down here. Oh, poopers. Oh, poopers. Um, wait, is there anything behind this block? Just gotta... Because I know they hide something behind something in this one, so I'm gonna look behind stuff in this one. Stop it! Go that way. Nope. This way. There you go. Uh, okay. Going down. Oh! I said going down. And we encounter something here. Oh! Look at that cute little fluttering critter. Mario, did you see it? That was a jabby! Based on what Poonipur said, they're helping the intruders and trying to seize the tree. Our tribes have been enemies for a long time now. Every time we meet, we fight. A lot. But I used to get along with Jabby. He's one of the Jabby tribe. I wonder if even Jabby is my enemy now. Well, hopefully not. Uh, let's go through here and see what's up. He's got to shake stuff up. Shake, shake! Uh-oh! Uh Uh-oh! Everyone, it's the Jabbies! It's a 10 Jabby squadron! Uh, let's get them! Come on, Mario! Uh, as far as I can tell, you can go over there and swing your hammer all you want, but you don't really have any control over this fight as far as I can tell. So it seems like 50-50 whether or not you win fights like this in the game. And yeah, <laughs> it's it's kind of silly, but it, that's how, how it works. So you just got to keep going in here until you win the fights. Oh no, oh no, oh I lost. It's not good. He walked all over us. We have to regroup and try again. By regroup, they just come back out here. Oh, George, you can't believe we lost. We'll definitely beat them next time, though, right? Yes, we will. Well, maybe. It's 50 50. <laughs> Rematch right now. Let's do it. Mm, go, 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 go. Mm. Oh, oh, I really don't think. I'm making any sort of impact whatsoever by doing this. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, look, this looks like victory! This looks like victory! Wow, that was a complete shutout this time. Well, not, maybe not complete shutout, there's one one of our team down. But we defeated them all! <laughs> now we have to destroy the Jabby High Fortress! Why do we want to do this? Well, there's a reason. Oh! Up oh, there we go. <laughs> there's something behind there. What is this something? Well, there's a something something. Uh, do I want... Hold on a sec. Oh, yeah. I need stuff for that. Hmm? I'll, first, I'll get this blue key. Yes, with the, this key, we should be able to open the cell and my, the cell my people are locked in. Hurry, we have to feed my sister and the others. Uh, this, this is something for later, so don't even bother with that now. Um, okay, let's just go back, and, hmm, I wonder, maybe I should grab the others way, way back at the beginning. So, oh, oh, look, cutscene. And they'll never come back, and that's that. What's gonna happen to us, and, hey, by the way, what's that thing you've been holding on to so tightly? So that one definitely is not very hopeful. It's a mushroom. Uh, that looks like a very dried mushroom. Oh, um, not to be, you know, rude, but it looks all dry and wrinkly and gross. Yeah, yeah, I know. I picked it so I could give it to my brother to eat, but then I got captured and stuck in here, and after a few days it dried out. Oh, really? Great story. Anyway, don't worry so much. And all my complaining aside, I'm sure Punio will to return. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, maybe so. Anyway, I'm gonna go cut ahead until I get back up to the cell or until some sort of event happens along the way. What? How did that one miss? That's baloney! And here we are. Batuni, I'm back! We brought the key! We're opening the cell right now! Go, 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 go! Follow it, follow it, follow it, follow it! Hurry up and open it! Okay. Blue key! 
Yay! Look at all of them. <laughs> Big brother. Yeah, I'll just encircle those two. Little patootie! Are you alright? You're not hurt, are you? Nope, I'm fine. Thank heavens. Hey, big brother. I have something for you. I meant to give this to you sooner, bud. Yep. Mushrooms are your favorite, aren't they, big brother? But, well, this one kind of got dried out. Oh. <laughs> big brother. It was icky, wasn't it? I'm sorry. No, not <laughs> not at all. Mm -mm. Delicious, very um, <laughs> very <laughs> yummy. <laughs> Big brother, you okay? Give me a hug, Petuni. Hey, quit it, Petunio. Come on, don't get all mushy. Everyone's staring. Well, it was just a really sweet gesture. That's all. Oh, oh, it was nothing. And now we have 101 Dalmatians! Or punies. So let's go! Come on, guys. Come on. Everyone. Oh, Jesus is. Come on. <laughs> uh oh, this is not. Oh, come on. This. Uh oh. How do I just do this? And then I do this. And then they should all be out of the cell. There we go. They're all stuck inside the cell, dang it. <laughs> Alright. Going back down. Um, still can't jump off the edge because the punies will not follow me, unfortunately. But man, we've got a lot of them. <laughs> uh, some people think that this might be a reference to Pikmin, but I'm not so sure about that. I mean, they, they do have similar balls on their heads, like Alamar and and the like. Um, you know, had antennas and whatnot, and they they uh. You, you got a whole bunch of them in your party, like the way Pikmin would follow you, but besides that, there's not all that many more similarities to that. Well, I mean, I, I mean, there's no, like, controlling their battles or anything like that and whatnot. So, yeah, I'm not exactly sure if it is in the... Oh, no, 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 81. No, not 81. Oh, wait, actually, I should show you something here. Uh, since I lost some, I can have the Elder Column here. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I'm not really sure if it's a Pikmin reference or not. So yeah, you whistle. Hey, what's the matter? Um, I'll just say hi. Are you ready, Mario? A crystal star at the very bottom of the tree. For the sake of the puny tribe's future, you mustn't give it to those thugs. Uh, I lost some puny. Oh, wait, I love you. Well, I'm shocked. Who makes fun of an old woman like that? Honestly. Uh, if I were just ten years younger, I'd show you. Oh, you best believe it. I'll have you know that in my younger days, I was considered a puny prize. I had so many suitors, I had to fight them off. <laughs> now that I think about it, there was a particularly fine boy named Poonderton. Um, two hours later. <laughs> and that's how I became the puny elder, the leader of the puny tribe. Now you know my tale, and I know yours, so good luck to you. So I guess uh, she was pretty much the Mario of her time and that she was getting guys left and right just like Mario gets girls left and right. Anyway, whistle for those punies. I understand the situation, just wait a moment. PUNIES! And here they are. Alright, Mr. Mario, off you go now. Alright, I just wanted to show that. And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.